Hi dear students, Santosh here and today I am going to deliver the lecture on the steel fibers and these steel fibers are used as a reinforcing elements in any non-reinforced concrete to increase its strength in impact as well as resistance to the freezing and thawing as well as it reduces the crack growth and also other characteristics of concrete. So, let us start this lecture on the steel fiber, but before starting this lecture, if you are interested in my lectures, then you subscribe my channel and press the like button. Okay, so let us start this lecture on the steel fiber. Steel fiber, steel fiber kya hota hai? Yeah, what is, what do you mean by steel fiber? Steel fiber is used as a reinforcing element in the concrete which is defined as a short discrete length of steel fibers with an aspect ratio from about 20 to 100 with different types of cross sections and that are sufficiently small to be randomly dispersed in an unhardened concrete mixture using the usual mixing procedures. So first of all you must know the aspect ratio. What is the aspect ratio? It is the ratio of length to diameter it is the ratio of length to diameter so that is aspect ratio and what are the normal using mixing what are the different mixing procedures of concrete it can be mixed manually it can be mixed with the concrete mixer it can be mixed with the drum mix or batch mix type of plants so that are the usual mixing procedures of the concrete Fiber reinforced concrete has more tensile strength when compared to the non reinforced concrete. It is quite obvious because concrete is very strong in compression but it is very weak in tension. To avoid this deficiency all the time concrete is reinforced. It increases the concrete's durability. Do you know what is durability? Durability is resistance to the weathering agencies or resistance to the weathering or atmospheric agencies. So, that <coughs> increases with that steel fiber and it also increases the impact resistance as well as it increases the resistance against freezing and thawing action means it is very good in cold temperatures also and hot temperatures also so steel fibers are very useful as a reinforcing element then we are going to discuss the various types of steel fibers According to shape, <laughs> they are classified as a straight fiber. This, this one is a straight fiber. Then crimped fiber. This one is the crimped one. Then standard fiber. Standard fiber is look like this. Then hooked fiber. There is formation of hook here. And twisted fiber. It is just like a tor steel that are twisted fibers. And the cross section may be elliptical. May be a triangular it may be a circular these are the different shapes or cross sections of that steel fiber steel fiber according to um, they are classified as different types cold drawn wire if it is prepared from wire and it is cold drawn then it may be a cut sheet means it may be in wire form it may be in sheet form it may be extracted for melt melt extracted it is shaved cauldron wire and it is milled from the blocks also it is milled from the steel blocks also these are the different types of that steel fiber according to method of their preparation or method of manufacturing then the length of this steel is typically from 30 to 60 mm that is this length this length is 30 to 60 mm Okay, so accordingly you can derive the diameter from the aspect ratio. Then normally used steel fibers are hooked end steel fibers. The hook is formed in this way. This is hooked. And the following figure shows the 3D fiber having capacity of holding up to 100 kg tensile strength and up to stress of 1000 to 1200 megapascal. MPA means 
न्यूटन पर एम एम स्क्वायर दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट देन बेनिफिट्स ऑफ स्टील फाइबर वॉट इज द बेनिफिट ऑफ यूजिंग द स्टील फाइबर्स इन द नॉन रेनफोर्स कॉन्क्रीट द वर्कैबिलिटी इज इंक्रीज वर्कैबिलिटी वॉट इज द वर्कैबिलिटी ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट इट इज द एस विथ विच कॉन्क्रीट कैन बी कॉम्पैक्टेड मिक्सड प्लेस्ड एंड वेरियस ऑपरेशन वॉट आर परफॉर्म ऑन दैट कॉन्क्रीट दैट आर सिंप्लीफाइड ड्यू टू दिस वर्कैबिलिटी सेकेंड इज द फ्लेक्सिबिलिटी ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट थर्ड इज द टेंसल स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट देन ड्यूराबिलिटी ड्यूराबिलिटी इज ऑल्सो इंक्रीज बाय कंट्रोलिंग एंड रिड्यूसिंग द क्रैक विड दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो दी स्टील फाइबर्स मे बी यूज इन रूरल एंड अर्बन रोड्स विथ रिनफोर्सिंग ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट विद दिस हुक्ड स्टील फाइबर्स देन डक्टिलिटी देन कोहेजन इंटरमोलिकुलर अट्रैक्शन इज कॉल्ड एज अ कोहेजन देन डक्टिलिटी मीन्स इट इज मोल्डेड इन टू ए शीट और डक्टाइल देन फ्रीजिंग एंड थॉइंग रेजिस्टेंस आई डिस्कस्ड अर्लियर देन एब्रेशन एंड इम्पैक्ट रेजिस्टेंस ऑल दीज प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ कॉन्क्रीट इज इंक्रीज बाय यूजिंग दी स्टील फाइबर्स सो दी स्टील फाइबर्स आर वेरी बेनिफिशियल फॉर एनी नॉन रिनफोर्स कॉन्क्रीट देन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द टिपिकल एप्लीकेशन ऑफ द स्टील फाइबर स्टील फाइबर्स आर यूज इन हाईवेज एंड एयरपोर्ट वेर देर इज अ रिजिड पेमेंट एंड विच इज नॉन बिटुमनस इन सच अ केस इन कॉन्क्रीट पेमेंट्स रिजिड पेमेंट्स इन हाईवेज एंड एयरपोर्ट दी स्टील फाइबर्स मे बी यूज देन इन मशीन फाउंडेशन दी स्टील फाइबर्स आर यूजफुल देन हाई एंड मासिव स्ट्रक्चर्स हाई एंड मासिव स्ट्रक्चर्स सच एज अ रेसिडेंशियल इंडस्ट्रियल इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर्स वन कैन यूज दी स्टील फाइबर्स देन शॉर्ट क्रिटिंग ऑफ कैनल्स शॉर्ट क्रिटिंग ऑफ टनल्स इट इज ऑन द लैंड स्लाइड्स पोर्शन एंड माइन्स इट इज यूज देन फ्लोरिंग इंडस्ट्रियल एंड कमर्शियल फ्लोरिंग वेयर हेवी फ्लोरिंग इज यूज इन सच अ फ्लोरिंग वेयर देर इज अ कॉन्क्रीट फ्लोरिंग वी कैन यूज द स्टील फाइबर्स इन इंडस्ट्रियल एंड कमर्शियल बिल्डिंग्स देन प्रिकास कॉन्क्रीट मेम्बर्स सच एज अ ब्रिजेस एंड कलवर्स इन प्रिकास कॉन्क्रीट मेम्बर्स वी कैन यूज the steel fibers then seismic resistant structures means in earthquake earthquake zones we can use the steel fibers then in blasting structures we can use the steel fibers then hydrodynamic structures we can use the steel fibers and in bus and truck terminals or stations we can go for the steel fibers where their use of concrete is must in such a situation we can reinforce this concrete with steel fibers and to adhere with the latest technology the steel fibers are very important in future days of concreting so thank you for listening my this short lecture and for more details and notes you may please contact my administrator also my email id is there swkulkarni72 @gmail.com you can mail me on your topics or you can write comments on my youtube channel so thank you for listening my lecture calmly and peacefully mitranno he steel fiber tumhala nishchitach bhavishyat concrete sathi kamala yu shaktat tyasathi he chote se vyakhyan mi apna samor sadar kele dhanyawad ani maje channel subscribe karayla visru naka dhanyawad bye